Welcome back to part five of the Civic EK slash EJ. I'm not really sure what it is. Build. Things are getting serious now. I did a bit of uh, de-rusting. You know, I started off here. Because uh, that was a bit scabby. And I've cleaned most of that off. There's a little bit you're missing there. It's going over again. Um, and then, you know, you see it a little bit more, don't you? You see that. And then you see a bit when you go, I'll just keep going over here. And then I'll just, I'll just, uh, and then you've done all that. And then there was that bit uh, under there. Needs doing some more. And then I just gave the cross member a quick. <whistles> and then, you know, before you know it, you get carried away, don't you? Colour looks really nice when it's got a bit of light on it. It's a lovely colour. Lovely. Even up there, like, I even gave that a bit of treatment with the acid. So now I'm debating, do I take the do I take the headlights out? Do I take the bumper off? Do I go in a little bit more? Well, you know, while the engine's out, there's nothing in here. Shall I just, shall I just do it real quick? Say real quick. Mm. Coilovers are gonna look good. So those wheels are terrible. And I'm gonna put the coupe wheels on it because they're alloys and you know, a bit better than these. Oh, I mean, there's brackets that could, that could it could clean up really well, isn't it? Oh, do you know what I mean? I'm getting excited, I'm getting carried away. I've still got that one to do. I was just gonna just clean it up, just quick. Waz the engine in. Drive it for a year. And then, you know, do some, do some further restorations. Or do I do it now? Took it outside, give it a bit of a jet wash, just to, just to clean it up, you know, just so we can see what we're dealing with. I might have to take some more bits off. So I might have, I might have taken a few more bolts out, um, just, just for the now, just for the now, you know, just, uh, nothing broke apart from this, this headlight. Turns out you don't need to actually take that bolt out, you just need to loosen it. Okay, well you learn something new every day, don't you? This is what I was nervous about. I've taken off the uh, arch liner and it's, it's not rotten. I think I've just caught this one in time. Bit of surface stuff going on there. But compared to the red one in this picture, this is a lot better. This is good. Good news. Oh yes, we've got a broken spring. Look at it. This looks like it's. I know. I know what you're thinking. I know. It looks like some kind of. This is, if you put some bubbles on this, it's like going around the Titanic, isn't it? <laughs> It'll be all right. This is what we have to put up with in Britain. Let's see. I can catch all this before it gets nasty. <coughs> if you sort that, we can fix it. It isn't that bad. The brakes are a bit. But this has been stood for nearly nearly two years. So uh, yeah, so mm, look at that. Some kind of protection. 
not enough protection but let's see what the other side's like okay so so this side um, I took the I took the wing off because uh, it just seemed appropriate but again it's not horrendous just a bit scabby so yeah it's pretty good Oh, okay until you uh, until we get under there but uh, that's that's gonna be sorted that's that's you know yeah we're on that so uh, so just need to find my lance for the pressure washer that's good enough to to get this crap off here and uh, I'll take it back out and give it another blast in like there's there's three or four kilos that don't need to be there to just empty it <laughs> it's in the way Let's relocate that to the boot but uh yeah that's uh, it's not it's not too bad is it it's not too bad i've seen worse <laughs> i've seen on far newer stuff so, you know, what's this? S98? That's old. Is that 22? 20 years old? 22? I don't know. 22, 21, 20, 22. Who cares? It's old. It's a classic. Can't let this go, can I? Can't let it. Boost. So, this wing is now off the driver's side wing. The right front. Um, it's it's not too bad under here. Just needs a good clean up. And, uh, yeah, it's good. Okay, now put the wheels back on and put it back on the ground. And then uh, let's see about popping all these uh, plastic clips off. I just want to stop it from rusting really, that's all I want to do basically, stop it from rusting further. I know these, this, whole, this whole front panel can be replaced, that's not really a problem. We'll see, let's see how it goes. So I hit it with the uh, knotted wire wheel on the grinder and uh, that happened. So let's get a hole in that. So I need that needs welding up. Cutting back. I'm just gonna put a piece in there to sort that out. But it's uh, it's cleaned up pretty well under here. But this is this is the kind of thing that needs sorting now. Otherwise it's gonna be a problem. And there's gonna be nothing left of this. In the future. I need to get on it. Too much. <laughs> and just cleaning up the rest of the metal work under here to get the surface stuff off and then we're gonna go under there and attack all that stuff uh, so yeah it's uh it's getting there so you, see, you keep finding bits that you've missed you need to just go over again and <laughs> sort out get in there with the acid neutralize that stuff that's what it looks like after it's been, uh, after it's had some acid on it. Oh, I'm going to put some more on that. But uh, yeah, it's pretty good. You put it straight onto bare metal, it'll protect it for, as I've already seen, a long time. 
obviously as soon as you start chipping away at the sound deadening you find more holes great so next time let's see how it's gone from this to this <laughs>